Jeep. Oh, yeah, yeah. Kept his mouth shut for 17 years in San Quentin. Stroker, no stroke. Old school gangbang Mexicans don't have the feds. Yeah, all right, already. All right, it was worth a try, at least. We gotta kick Pink Men loose. Ah, it's all right. He's nobody anyway. What, you oh. tell me you buy that lame-ass story is? I buy that lame-ass story more than I buy it. He had anything to do with shooting Tuco. Hey, Phil. Hey, Phil, in the middle of nowhere, nobody followed. Oh, how'd it go? <sighs> okay. You? I swear it makes my tape, but finally cut me loose. So you getting out of there? Tomorrow. So who, who came for you? The DEA? What did they ask you? You all son of a bitch laughed in my face. Now I got like 80 bucks to my name. Wait, wait. What does he know? Does he, does he know what you're running? No, man. He doesn't, he doesn't know shit, okay? The plan works. We bought it. I got bills due, man. I'm screwed. Did he mention my name? No. Oh, thanks for caring. <laughs> there are Badger's cousin took it to his garage. It's safe. Can he get it running again? Why? So we can cook. <laughs> you still want to cook? Heck yeah, he want to cook. You got a plan. What's changed, Jesse? Yeah, I broke out of the hospital. Mm hmm. Or he got Jesse to do it. <laughs> His face. <sighs> making too much noise. Yeah. Make sure it's all taped down. I don't think it is. It's breakfast time. Oh, so everybody awake in the house. How does he get out of this? Yeah, get out of it. Oh, he got out of it. Explanation. Boy, I'm not saying it. It's making my head hurt. It's because you're working that ugly melon too hard. It's dead around here. Let's go get a couple of beers. It's 11 in the morning. Mm. I'm buying. You're buying. Holy crap. Took sick of the mile already? Oh, yeah. He said it's 11 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. Congrats, man. What's this? Ah! Look at that! They got the gut right. There you go. <laughs> hey, 
thanks, man. Thank you. We all got you a little something, and it's from all of us. Nah, you shouldn't have. Oh, you sick, sick fuck. <laughs> Yeah. I see uh, Mark and the Beast there, huh? Oh, yeah. Marie stopped by this morning. They really cheered the place up. So, um, tell us about the shootout. Ah, I was doing my job. The whole thing was over in about uh, five seconds. Hey, Walt, uh, you know, how, how are you? I'm okay. Really, I'm, I'm being fine. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the doctor is calling it a isolated episode of transient global amnesia. Damn. <laughs> Which means not recurring. No, no not recurring. That, that sounds good. Yeah. Sounds real good, huh? I'll tell you what, I'm glad you're back. You know, you really gave us a scare. Going out there looking for me put you in danger, and I'm so s sorry. Sorry doesn't even cut it. Not nearly. Ah, no, 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 no. Is that what you're worried about? <laughs> no, no, no. Look, the office, they treat me like I'm Elliot Ness, okay? Hey, I'm in the they threw me a party, the gals baked me a chocolate chip cake, which you wouldn't believe, Jeez. okay? They gotta uh, disappear more often. Part of, part of <laughs> Just kidding. the group of people at the poker poker mm -hmm. game. Uh, okay. Blew up. It was his house. Oh, they gave me. They gave me. What is it? Uh, <gasps> it's his grill. It's the grill of the guy I shot. Mm. So, his True. Grill. Yeah, it's uh, kind of little, 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 I was just thinking about going out at 7 Eleven. Do you need anything? <laughs> Big cold. Told you. <laughs> this will not happen again, okay? I won't let it. Hmm. I'm still here. I'm me. And we're going to be okay. Do you have a second cell phone? Oh. A second cell phone? The night you disappeared, you came in and I was taking a bath and you were very upset. It's like something terrible had happened. And then your cell phone rang. I saw you check the number and then you got up and just disappeared. Oh, I missed my mouth. Yeah. And when Hank checked your phone records, there was no call, no call on the phone I know about. Mm. I mean, I don't remember any of that. But one thing I am sure of is that I don't have a second cell phone. Would you lie about it though? Yeah. <sighs> I mean, but they had to lie throughout the whole episode mm -hmm. for everything. Like, why did he end up in the 7 Eleven but naked or the grocery mark, whatever, wherever he was? Everything. Everything. <laughs> oh man, that was good. Um,. Yeah, Jesse is about to lose his mind now. He's going through it because <laughs> he got had to, uh, all the money that he had. He had to give to uh, the guy that tore away the RV, and he's still owing him more. 
they they, they got the, all of his money that he had saved. In the car. In the car, from the car, yeah. Man. Here's my thing. If you knew that you had that much that much money still in the car, I understand the whole situation, but when they were in the car and they got out the car, I would have been grabbing that money. Yeah, that would have been one thing I would have grabbed. Yeah, you're right. I mean, I understand what was going on because they were just trying to get it, get out the get way. out the yeah. you know get away because mm -hmm. Tuka they had already shot Tuco but they were trying to get away. From well, they were trying to get away from what well, they didn't know oh, it was Hank. They thought yeah. it was Tuco's family coming through mm -hmm. um, to take them back to Mexico or take them to Mexico. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I guess I would have. But at the same time. No, I would have been stashing. I had deep pockets. Some of that money would have been rolled real tight in my tidy whities uh, That's real talk. Sixty-eight thousand. The old man. The old. <laughs> listen, it's the OG. Not talking to the feds. Mm -hmm. He was like, "Yeah, okay, I'm gonna play y'all game. Yeah, I know I'm not on Mars. I'm not on Venus. I'm not on whatever, whatever. I know I'm on Earth." Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm not gonna tell you that this dude that's sitting across from me was at my house just yesterday mm -hmm. when my nephew or my son or whatever I it think was, it's his nephew when my nephew was trying to kill him anyway mm -hmm. come on yep 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 and his nephew is now dead yeah they was like 17 years he didn't talk for anything yeah so of course he's not gonna talk in the list of five minutes that you got him mm -hmm. in there he pooped something fierce to let them know he wasn't, he wasn't telling them Jack Sugar honey iced tea <laughs> He wasn't telling them nothing Oh man And the example of that was to poop all over yeah. the place That was disgusting Uh, Yeah and um, as you see at the end Scott her question about the second cell phone She gave him the cold shoulder this, jo hold on, this joker broke out the hospital Went to the house and stayed <laughs> To take the money out of the box where he hid it mm -hmm. in the Pampers, to put it back in the vent, taped down with duct tape, and, then and the gun the was in there himself. too. That sticking of the IV. Listen. Yeah. Yeah. That was a good episode. Came in for the next one. I don't understand the title of that one. <laughs> oh. Well. Oh, I get it. I get it. Because mm -hmm. Tuco's dead. Mm -hmm. So the whole memory of him being dead and they brought the uncle in and then he has the grill. Mm -hmm. Hank has the grill. So it was just a reminder. You know, he's going to be walking around with this grill. It's just a reminder of what they had to go through because they almost died. Tuco was going to take them out for mm -hmm. real. So yeah, uh, dead B stinging. Yeah. Still hurts. Yeah. So let us know what you guys thought of that episode. Yeah. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, subscribe, you guys. We'll see y'all next time. No spoilers. Love no spoilers. Love Bye. you. Bye-bye.